Me? Yeah. Oh, biking? That started a long time ago. Started when I was about eight years old. So I'm about, about 30, coming on 30 years now into biking. And one day, ended up in a park where I seen dirt jumps. Two of us kind of thought, you know what, we could do that. That was when I was 15, 32 now, and I'm still trying to do it. From the beginning? Uh, yeah, I started BMX in around Christmas time. I was not a hardtail first for dirt jumping and stuff, but for the park downstairs, BMXing is pretty much the way to go. And I had two friends from Dublin that lived in Galway then, with a house, with a big field out the back of the house. And about six months later, we had a field full of dirt jumps, and the only reason we left it, because it was Baltic cold. <laughs> when I set up the park here with the pump track, just to get that going, and we had the units going, just set up a few ramps, you know, use the hall and do something indoors because of the rain all the time. Basically the weather gets bad so what we needed is an indoor park just to plot about basically. So I suppose Gary came up with the idea, we'll stick a few ramps inside a unit, see how we get on. Had a good response so it kind of went from there really. service side of it just was in a heap and then there was a hole in the BMX market there was nothing for BMXing you know. But it's been good so far it's been about maybe seven eight months I've been on the BMX and the amount I've progressed just inside the park is is crazy to what I could do before. It's just a mental BMX community here you now. There's enough people there for a market to set up an indoor park. We took it from there. Started building a few small ramps and then got the mad idea to put the bowl in and that's where it is now. And there's more and more kids joining every day basically to the park, uh, which is good basically. It gets them to do something other than hanging around basically, you know, all the time. There's kids now, there's kids now. Literally 12 years old that are doing tricks. Tricks that I can even do some of them and I'm watching them doing the same trick that I know I can do and I'm thinking I can't even nearly do it as good as they're doing it. We have our own regular riders in and they're riding the whole time so you know it's it's predictable now who's doing what and there's always new people taking it up but there's steady riders here like since we opened still at it and getting better at it. to ride the bike, where to put their feet. They're too good. They're learning too fast and it's savage to see. I didn't, like I thought we'd cover a lot of what's in Galway but the village alone was about 45 BMXers and I was only thinking we might get five or six. And the club to this date has 152 members. It's far more integrated now around the country. Like it's not just different counties now. Everyone seems to know each other now from either Facebook or whatever it is, traveling around or whatever, but I think a lot of people just didn't know what we were doing or it's hard to get, get it going, but I think now if I'm going forward there's a bit of help there, you know. So far everybody's liked the park, everybody's loved it so far, even people coming down from Dublin, Ballina, all over Ireland, even you know from different countries people have come down as well. No matter where you go, you, you tend to know someone where you're going anyway, like BMX wise entire community and what it was before and there's a lot of up and comers, a lot of young kids starting. Makes it more worthwhile, you know, and a lot of people follow and support it. 
and share the experience with a lot of people, you know. Walk to the night all the way to the bright